Hey guys, what's up? It's Freddy Jr. here, and I'm doing a gameplay and commentary over some nice Modern Warfare 3 gameplay with the AK-47, and, uh, well, no, I actually get a Moab this gameplay, which is pretty nice. It was my first and last AK-47 Moab, and that's mainly because the AK-47 pretty much sucks in this game, but, I mean, I mean, if you use it enough, uh, you can probably get used to it and do a little better with it. I know lately I've been using it a lot. And it's, it's pretty good once you get the hang of it, because it's got some crazy recoil. And I really don't understand why Infinity War decided to trash the, the AK-47 in this game. Because, I mean, it was so good in, in Black Ops, Modern Warfare 3, I mean 2, and uh, in the other game, Call of Duty 4. It was so good in those games. And then they just had to trash it completely in, uh, in this game. So, yeah, I, I don't really understand the thought process that they took with that. And it's a pretty high unlock, so I don't get what they were thinking. But anyways, getting we're getting a little off topic. What I wanted to talk about in this uh, commentary is internet tough guys and hating on videos and all that good stuff. And I know I've done a commentary on this back a long time ago in the Black Ops days. Black Ops days, and uh, that's mainly because about that time was a time that I was getting so much hate on my videos. And that was back in the day when I had like a high voice. Lately, I like I literally get no hate on my videos, which is pretty nice, you know. And that, obviously that probably comes along with, uh, because my voice is deepening a little bit. Which is kind of annoying because it shows that, you know, that your voice, for some reason, plays such a huge part in how well you do on YouTube. But I mean, for some people, it doesn't really affect it. Like, for example, Advanced UAV, he's doing just fine. Because, uh, you know, I guess everyone feels bad for him, which is kind of annoying. But anyways, getting off topic again. I wanted to talk about Internet Tough Guys and why they're so annoying and... You know, coming from me starting my channel when I had such a such a high voice and I got so much hate on my videos. You just click on any one of my old old Modern Warfare 2 videos and just look at all the hate I got. Oh my god! But uh, I, I I kept uploading videos. I mean, back in the day, I used to upload videos like every every day, which is pretty cool. But uh, you know, I, I tried my best to ignore it. I actually I actually didn't really ignore it. I actually retaliated a lot, which is something you probably shouldn't do because I mean. By retaliating like that, like whenever someone hates on me, I just block them and give them a little wise ass comment reply. You probably shouldn't do that because that's kind of what the haters are trying to achieve. So, if someone's hating on your videos. If you're an up and, up and coming YouTuber and someone's hating on your videos, you know, instead of hating on them completely back and just saying, oh, you're a fag, don't hate on me, blah, 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 and uh, you should just ask them what exactly was it about this game. Or commentary that you found made you decide to go all internet tough guy because in all seriousness if you really want to hate on a video just you know calm down a little bit you know squeeze the stress ball and think about a way that you can actually give this guy some help you know because if you don't like a video obviously there was something wrong with it or maybe it just wasn't your taste but obviously something's wrong with it if a lot of people don't like your video and you should ask what exactly is wrong with it again if you look at all my uh, old videos I was always asking for constructive criticism, and I still kind of do now, not as much, because I, th I think I've kind of found what I like with YouTube, and I'm just kind of sticking with it, so I don't really ask for c criticism anymore. Uh, so, you know, ask the hater, listen, what exactly didn't you like about this, you know, and, and if you're really in a bad mood, you can always just retaliate and be mean and do like a spelling correction like I sometimes do when a hater hates on me, I I'll, I'll be like, oh, you spelled this wrong, her. <laughs> But, uh, you know, you probably shouldn't do that. Because, again, that's like accepting defeat. That's giving the hater what they want to hear. So, that's pretty much all I wanted to talk about this commentary, guys. It's just how to help you guys ignore the haters. You know, you would realize it's the final thing that you have to realize is it's the internet, and it's exactly like the Special Olympics. Whoever wins is still retarded, you know? That's just the uh, basis of it, so... See you guys later. I hope I gave you guys some uh, help if you are up-and-coming YouTubers and you have high voices. I know a lot of my, su my, my fan base is, you know, young kids. So, yeah, that's it for this one, guys. Uh, see you later. Uh, if you enjoyed it, please like the video and comment below what you think. And I will see you guys all later.